yeah, if the big blind folds too much, but there are five people between us and the big blind, we can open maybe one or two hands that we couldn't otherwise. But you can't go much further than that because all these other people are going to play against you too. Somebody who their leak is that, you know, post flop, they're just super weak tight. If they miss the flop, they check fold. Well, now if they open in the cutoff and it's folded to me in the big blind, I can play most hands because I'm just going to steal the pot later. But if they open in early position and two other players call, being able to bluff one of the three of them out of the pot more easily is not really helping my weak hands. I just want to give you this general rule of as you're making these preflop adjustments, don't overdo it in spots where more people can enter the pot than, than the one that you're targeting. Basically, all of us take our preflop adjustments too far because we, we like to play more hands. It's more fun. So err on the side of, of not taking them too far. But if you want to take them too far, do it when it's a heads up pot.